So, me and my friend, we're going to Tamashi Ramen. Ugh, best ramen place in town. But as I'm waiting, because it's 2.09 and we're going at 2.30. So, I'm thinking about door dashing for a little bit. But over the course of a week, this week, actually the months, everything has just been accumulating. So, it's bringing me to this point now. And there is so much power that I'm learning when I tell my mind, no, no, no. Like, y'all, it's crazy. I've been asking for freedom, right? This concept of freedom. And I've figured, like, I look around and I'm like, I feel free already. No matter what comes, I already feel freedom. So where is this urge to seek freedom coming from? my mind i need freedom from my mind and so as i'm going through like i'm going through this kind of ego this transformation i'll say transformation and transformation includes ego deaths right so i'm learning to tell myself no when my when my ego say overeat overeat no and it brings power back to me when it says oh you may want that no bring it back to me when it's looking at what somebody else has no bring it back to me bro there's so much power in telling these versions of ourselves. no no i'm not putting up with your bullshit no no we're not doing it no no and that's that and if you feel like that doesn't resonate if you feel like that's well why would you do that it's probably your ego talking. I'm not even gonna hold you. It's probably your ego because ego does not like to be told no. It likes to be fed, right? Just as we feed the good parts of ourselves, we also feed the shadow parts. And the shadow parts don't like to be told no because they like to run game on you. They like to run game on our mind. My ego's been running game over here. I'm like, bro, y'all smart as hell. Y'all are really smart as hell. That's crazy. But no, not anymore no but i absolutely love to see it because i'm seeing how much power no has and how much better things come when i say no i'm not doing that no 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 baby no we're not doing that alexandria we're not doing that today we're not doing that no but we can redirect no but let's redirect no but let's redirect uh, listen I've, I'm just listening to the reading he's like this week you're going to be telling people no and then it hit me boom the more I tell myself no and I have discipline why the fuck would I hesitate in telling you no that is crazy that's so crazy because that is really something I I'm learning like how do I just say no and I haven't really had actually no I haven't learned how to tell people no because I just don't respond that is my way of coping of being like rather than saying no I just don't say any anything but like I said I've been learning to tell myself no like no I don't need to do that no I don't need to eat right now no I'm satisfied I'm satisfied a butterfly I'm satisfied I don't know no, no, you're not getting one over on me. <laughs> so if I can tell myself no, why the hell would I tell you yes if I don't want to? Why? Why? Oh my God, y'all. Y'all, I'm learning. I see, universe. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> that is just like so freeing. Freedom freedom y'all turn your volume down because when i get excited it's, it's it's all it's all raise the roof raise the roof if i tell myself no why would i tell you yes if i really don't want to why would i tell you yes boss energy says no when she really means no 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 I don't want to. No, no, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. And I can say it with a smile on my face. No, thank you. No, 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 thank you.
I'm gonna get you. Yeah! Tamashi ramen in your area. If you have a Tamashi ramen in your area, go there. Try it out. I always get the curry ramen. It's so good with chicken because I don't do pork. But with the chicken, don't even get me started. It smacks. It smacks every time. They do not disappoint. Those are cooks who love their fucking job. Okay? shit damn it's so good it's so good it's so good so good so yes now i'm about to figure out what i'm gonna do because i was gonna go to the park but it's a little toasty right now sun is high i don't mind door dashing i kind of just want to chill a little bit but i don't want to go home so we're gonna see what the universe has in store for me because i am just chilling to be honest with you so yeah good sunday brum day broom day. i don't know what i'm trying to say but it's a good sunday okay <laughs> okay we made it to the next destination so basically i'm gonna talk to y'all while i change but you won't be able to see anything i am at uh the lake and go paddleboarding and kayaking so i'm doing the paddleboard and i'm excited um Cause I was like, I want to go to the lake, but I don't know if I want to get in yet. Like I need to fill it out and I need a good space to do so. So that is what I'm doing right now. I'm excited. I know I just said that like twice, but I am. So I'm changing, getting in, ready to go. Could barely see anything, that's okay. I'm gonna take off my jewelry and go, okay? How's y'all stay going? How are you? How have you been? That's what I wanna ask, how have you been? What are you up to? What is something that's good, going good? Um, I know I talked about no's, so let me know in the comments below what you have been saying no to recently. I want to know. <laughs> okay, editor Alex here. So I noticed I'm not filling in between the days, so I'm going to leave it how it is. The next outfit you see me in is the next day. I wasn't doing rundowns. I'm sorry, y'all. Really how it was going was it just whenever I got the inspired action to record, I would just record. So if I didn't feel inspired the rest of the day, I was not recording anything. Therefore, I did not give a synopsis of the day. But I will give one for today. Today's Thursday. I'm recording Monday through today, I guess. Yeah, y'all gonna have to fill in the blanks. Love you though. Love you though. I'm really, I'm doing this YouTuber shit. It's just, just whenever I'm inspired, you know? Um, so I forgot to update. Went to the lake. Did paddle boarding. Beautiful experience. Sat with my higher self for a bit. Was chit chatting with her. Got the information I needed. Now I'm at home doing the lashes the lashes and they're looking good you see Percy he loved the camera I think he's a Leo I'm pretty sure he is so that means his birthday's coming up right Percy your birthday's coming up huh <laughs> I think so so yeah I forgot to update y'all that's what's going on yes the lashes are done. Let me get out of the bathroom. <sighs> Tea.
10, 10, 10 across the board. Okay. So I was thinking I do my lashes. I was going to do my nails, but something in me just wants to go out door dash. I feel like I got to make some money. I got stuff to pay for. Let me actually talk it out with y'all. So I feel like I'm in between the money situation, right? One hand, I know I'm good. I know everything's being done. I think I'm just trying to allow opportunity. No, what I'm telling you, no, let me give, no. Let me be radically honest. I feel like I don't have enough to pay for what I need to pay for. Is that the truth? That's the question. And I don't think it is. I think I actually have more than enough. I have more than enough. But my brain is still trying to resonate. See, I be talking with other people about this, but I'm radically honest. I think, yes. So I'm going to see. I'm going to see. And then, because actually, here's the thing too. I can just call, y'all, okay, basically what I have left. Ticket and car insurance. Car insurance I already know is done, so I don't know why I'm, but for my ticket with the state, I'm pretty sure I could just call them and let them know it's taking longer and they wouldn't mind because I've been paying consistently anyway. So it's just like unnecessary worry that I'm putting on myself. So, yeah, so I'm chilling, basically. I'm still probably gonna go out. <laughs> Not even gonna hold y'all, but at least I talked it out. That's what's important. At least I talked it out with myself and I'm being honest with myself. I can still do something about it. See, look, it just popped up. So I'm still going to do something about it, but at least I talked it out and I got it out. So now it's not up there. Now my egos aren't. So that's nice. update y'all yesterday basically went door dashing um got free food well no let me go back back to the beginning that's when i updated y'all i did my lashes and everything and then i was like okay i'm gonna go door dashing so i go door dashing and i go to buffalo wild wings and the person that i was door dashing for it they ended up ordering two orders and so i was like damn like and they let me keep one so i was like just an abundant they have 40 fucking pieces of wings and two bags of fries did not eat the fries fries weren't good but it was just the fact that i was abundant in food at the moment right just abundant and so yeah that was the experience it was really cool that chicken tore me up so that was also just a reminder that me and chicken are not good but i am still appreciative of that experience because it showed me these things can happen right i'm gonna close my ice cream with this gnat flying around like that so yes yeah, so today i'm now eating my ice cream working on my first ebook <laughs> y'all it's so good let me go let me read y'all some of it so right now i'm talking about energy spill it is simply your energetic point of focus, which dictates where your life goes. Energy is the compass. Your thoughts and feelings are the needle. Me. Like, are you serious right now? Like, I'm, I'm doing the damn thing. If our bodies make up 7 billion, 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 10 to the 27 power atoms, that is that much energy that makes up your body. That's a lot of fucking energy. So here we are with 8 billion people on the planet. I'm not going to try to do that math of how many atomic beings that would be. Each one, of, each one of us are carrying massive amounts of energy, energy of the cosmos within our very being. So I ask, what does your energetic field consist most of? 
positive or negative? Damn! Like, what the fuck? What the fuck? I'm really an author. I'm really an author. I'm. <laughs> so yes, that's what I've been doing today. I'm just really blown away by myself. Like I, who would have thought? And I say this, but my auntie has written a book. My father has written multiple books and my mother has written a book. So, I mean, it's in the blood, but the way my teachers used to act when I was in school writing, like, bro, get off me. I really don't understand why they would do the most. They really would do the most with my writing. And I'm like, this isn't even bad. Like, this is actually fucking good. Why are you, you know, you know, one thing I always say, the one, the most things that we are the most talented in, the world is going to hate, okay? The thing you are most talented in, the world is going to hate. And they're going to try to shut that shit down as a child. So when you grow up, you don't look into it. But when you sit down for a second and you're like, who the fuck are y'all? I know what the hell I'm doing. You get to creating and then it comes out like this, right? So keep creating. Whatever they told you to stop doing as a child, do it now. And I guarantee you, you are very good at it. Okay, I also redid my nails. So they're purple, green, and red. So yes, I'm gonna keep going and I will talk to y'all later. chicken and pickle they're having live music so I'm showing up I got a network I got to tune into my networking skills so that's what I'm doing and yeah
bro tell me this is not a look this is a look don't tell me it's not a look because it don't tell me it's not a look because this really is a <laughs> bro my beauty like really stuns me it really stuns me at times like i'm speechless actually okay so i figured i'd just sit on here and talk to y'all about the rest of the day so yeah like i said the networking went successful i the universe really has just been dropping me in places and spaces that i've as i've been manifesting and it's here it's here so i feel very grateful I feel at home. I feel like I know what I'm doing. Like, so the universe is just like, okay, we'll put her here. She knows what to do. We'll put her here. She knows what to do. It's like we're we're giving and receiving with one another. I'm dancing with the universe. So that feels good. That feels really good. Um, How's the rest of the night been going? It's been good. You know, I kind of feel high. And I mean, I have not smoked. I think it was just when talking about that, like, I'm just so, like, wow. <laughs> like, what is going on? What's going on? Um, one, one, one. So, yes. I'm grateful. So thankful, grateful. All of it! Uh, I'll be going to that Poetry and Chill Sunday. So, usually it's, like, poetry and stuff. Let me talk about that. Usually it's like poetry and stuff, but today they did like a a music live, so that was nice. I am sorry to that pianist and guitarist. I did not get their socials, but the drummer, Gregory, they were going crazy. I was like, okay, okay. So it was kids running around everywhere just being joyful. I'm like, hell yeah, this is the space to be. So overall, I guess I can do an overall summary. I don't think I'll record tomorrow. I think this is good. <laughs> Love y'all. I think this is good. Damn, my that's crazy. The purple and the my nails is off on the opposite hand. I'm sure y'all understood it the first time I said that I didn't need to keep going, but that's okay. <laughs> Anyways, the overall week. That's what I'm on. Y'all, ADHD is a thing. I just be flowing every which direction. <sighs> the overall week this week was good. It was such a great week. I remember Monday being like, this week is going to go by quick. I was like, it's Monday. But then I was like, that doesn't matter. You're not going to <laughs> I'm. I literally just let the days be the days and I'm just here. So... I'm only knowing it's Friday today because I'm looking at it. But other than that, I don't be knowing what day it is. I'm just here. That's the place to be. So the overall week was so good. It was so good. Um, blessed. Everything is working out. Everything is working out. I've going through this transformation. Like, yes, it was rough. It was a bit dark. And like, I was just like, but that's the most exciting time because now I can create nobody else's opinion. Nobody else's fear is in this space because it's only me. It's only me. It's only me versus me. So I get to rebuild. I get to rebuild, reprogram. And I've been doing that consistently. And it's just been so rewarding. Y'all, when you go through the uncomfortable moments, just allow it because it's trying to show you something and it's uh, the something that comes out of it is always just amazing it's always so amazing because i'm like wow look at this look at this artwork right when i first did it i didn't know what the hell i was doing i was like what is this but now when i look at it you see how the background is yellow yellow is the color of joy Happiness is always flowing, right? Happiness never stays. It's not a staying emotion. 
but joy is the sky color never changes but the clouds move away so whenever we go through uncomfortable moments look at the the blue and yellow i didn't even notice that but till just now but even in those uncomfortable moments we can still remain in a state of joy and peace because we know all these emotions will pass all these feelings will pass so it's no point in staying stuck really there's no point in staying stuck in the emotion just letting it go past and yeah so yeah i'll say the biggest the most things i've learned over the week was no the power of no really just going headstrong being honest with myself and not hesitating I'm, I feel like I'm doing it a little bit today and there's some stuff I have to work on. So it's 1224 a.m. And I'll probably be working a little longer. But I'm just so grateful to be able to say I get to choose to work long hours. Like it really blows my mind. I work for myself. I am working for myself. I get to choose to stay up this late and just work on my business. Like I get to choose that. This has been two years coming and I am really going ham. I'm doing the damn thing. Whatever you're doing, you're doing the damn thing because you're waking up and choosing it. One, one, one again. I just restarted this damn video to say some more things. Whatever you are doing, you get to choose. So when we choose self, it's so rewarding. This week has just really been, I've been able to see like, you're a hard worker, Alexandria, and not in a bad way. I'm like a bee. <laughs> Bees have been coming up a lot lately for me. But like, I'm, if I'm not doing this, I'm pivoting. If I'm not doing that, I'm pivoting. If I'm not doing this, I'm resting. If I'm not, I'm just being. Really though, in just every element. And it's so cool to like observe myself outside of work even emotionally regulating and internally regulating i'm just being and just allowing and seeing and just working to be more conscious of me of self of things around me so yeah and then i got to watch my uh uh family's dog my niece my brother's dog and then me and percy was chilling today so I know this conversation at the end was all over the place, but I figured I'd at least give y'all a synopsis. I said I wasn't going to do it, but here I am. That's also something I've noticed this week, too. Anytime it's like my, it's like, <laughs> it's so crazy. It's, I have reprogrammed my subconscious. Anytime I say I can't do something, I do it. I do it. I do it. Anytime I have said, even when I went to the lake this week, I told myself, I'm not going in that, in those bushels of trees. It's too much. And I went there. And then I said, I'm here. Anytime I've told myself, I'm not doing something. I can't do something. I do it. And it's so cool because it's not conscious anymore. I don't have to consciously force myself to do something. My subconscious is like, oh, she said, we can't do it so let's do it and it's like yes it's working for me it's working for me my brain is working for me <laughs> i said i wasn't going to the gym i'm going to the gym it's that discipline muscle i'm <laughs> that discipline muscle y'all y'all are just gonna get like a whole load of me just being grateful and like having realizations because i'm talking out loud but life is just good even in the down moments, life is still good. That is a blessing to say within itself. So, <laughs> I'm grateful. I'm about to get off of here so I can finish editing and ready and post this. 
so yes love y'all thank you for if you sat through this whole video thank you you are appreciated truly truly because i know i'm a mess a beautiful mess though a chaotic mess Cha we love to organize chaos within <laughs> uh, i'm a star stars just do whatever they want to do right I like a literal star i guess you could say hi uh, reality star as well but anyways let me get up off of here love y'all <laughs> hope you enjoyed this video like comment subscribe share if you feel like you want to laugh with somebody else and just enjoy the content together because that's what i'm here for community remember to tell me the no's you have said recently and i will talk to y'all later bye